to stop the thought, the feeling, the emotion, realize that you are projecting those feelings and emotions to a situation that do not belong, is not associated with them, is triggering them. The fact that you are failing your marketing, that you're failing your communication, the fact that it's complex, complicated, the fact that you feel not successful the work you do because a customer maybe communicate with you in a way you didn't expect because the person you were communicated didn't decide, opt in for becoming a lead for you, or because maybe a person that you are interested in has no time to listen to you. So if that is happening and you are feeling in those moments similar feelings that you had in your childhood or when you were young or the feelings you had a job in the company and university with your professors or with your parents or in your community and it's so difficult to bear in that moment you need to do an exercise of focusing on your purpose in that burning purpose in the heart the purpose that you're living in your life and once you have connected with that strongly, and we have some, have some techniques to do that also, then you can connect in the love and care you have for the people you want to serve. Do these two things so that you can differentiate, focus on your path, what you receive as an impulse, which is your purpose. Focus on your intention that is to be connected and serve that people care for them. Feel grateful for both of them and connect tremendously, powerfully with both of them because that will help you move on. And then once in a week, every three days, schedule a moment in which you read your journal and you work with those feelings that are really you know, draining you, blocking you, stopping you, you know, from, from within. 